Hey guys, what's up? A Gamer here, and today I'm gonna be showing you how to make a little floating base. So, I'm on my official server because I couldn't really avoid it, which is why I'm backspaced. Sorry about that. But anyways, um, you have this little base in the sky. As you can see, the stuff is mine, so I just did this. Um, but you can make a floating base kind of thing, but you can't put any beds up here or anything like that. So this is 66 high, which is the building limit, or some like that. I think 66. 60 something. Anyways. So I'm at the building limit. I think it's 63. Yeah. So I place these up here. You can actually place these even after you reach the building limit because I only stopped the wall. So I built this to the max height and then I put these on top. So once you do this, this thing is completely... Oop, I don't want to demolish the one I'm standing on. Then make sure I'm getting the right one there. They're completely um, like floating they don't need support from anything so you can put a cannon bear up here or anything like that and you can shoot anyone who puts an outpost below you so you'd want to make this a little bigger obviously probably oh three by three might be okay if you did a three by three and then go around the outer layer so go one below the building limit go with three by three and then go around that again with a half wall higher so that you'll get an angle right here this would make it where you can shoot further and people can't shoot your bear from below as easily so it would make it where let's like defend it up here and then to get up here you have to have a like let's say if we start building from the top of that rock over there or something like that it would be higher so you'd have to build these somewhat close to those that way you could have a tower on that and glide on top of these and these would just be like outposts in the sky with a cannon bear two on it and if you ever need to replace the cannon bear you'd have to build a ramp up here again so yeah it's not really convenient in that respect but since you can make a floating base it's really useful I've contacted Dolly about this haven't got a reply yet so I figured I'd get the video out there and you know it might be patched in the future but uh, <laughs> to be honest it, she has a lot worse things to deal with like the recent guillotine exploit where you get max level uh well level 150 <laughs> yeah higher level than any of the mega tribes at the moment even though this game really doesn't have a mega tribe yet like cstg would be up there but not really anyways so as you can see it's way up there you're not going to be able to shoot this with a cannon bear but it would be um, a sky defense that you guys could rely on. So, anyways, thank you guys for watching. I'm going to try and do more videos. I'm just getting into this game. I'm learning to stream. I do a lot of testing, but it's just so much one person can learn about a game at a time. When I started with Stark, I had 5,000 hours of like time on it. So, I pretty much knew the game already. This, I'm still learning it. I played it a little bit in early access. A lot's changed, though, since then. So, I'm trying to get back into it and learn and yeah anyways guys thanks for watching take care don't forget to like and subscribe and tell me what you want to see me do next if you guys have any thing you would like me to make a video on tell me and i'm really gonna try and get back into this youtube thing i'm sorry i took so much time off from it but i really got burnt out and need to eh, a new perspective. I needed to go find a game that was fun that I could get back into because I lost interest in art because of my tri my tribe fell apart and it hurt me pretty bad because I spent so much time with them. They're like family. So anyways guys, take care.